Losing weight is a common desire for many individuals throughout the globe. Whether it's for health reasons to enhance physical attractiveness or to build self-confidence, the desire to remove those excess pounds is a universal feeling. Many concentrate on the number on the scale, believe that a lower weight translates to improved health and fitness. However, this is a frequent misperception. However, body composition is more significant than weight. Understanding the difference between reducing weight and shedding fat is vital for reaching long-term health and fitness objectives. This entails knowing the ratio of muscle mass to body fat. A healthy body composition entails maintaining or developing muscular mass while minimizing excess body fat. Losing muscle mass may have negative repercussions such as diminished strength, a slower metabolism, and an increased risk of damage. It's not only about the number on the scale, but about what that number symbolizes it is vital to detect the indicators of muscle loss. These might include feeling weaker, experiencing tiredness more rapidly, and detecting a loss in muscle size or tone. This post will highlight the primary symptoms that you may be losing muscle instead of fat. By recognizing these indications, you may take efforts to adapt your training program and nutrition to keep muscle mass. We will address the relevance of retaining muscle mass during weight reduction. Engaging in resistance exercise and ingesting appropriate protein are crucial techniques for retaining muscle while decreasing weight. It's crucial to understand that everyone's body is different. Factors like his age, gender, genetics, and lifestyle all play a part in how we lose weight and gain muscle. Weight loss journeys are unique. What works for one person may not work for another, and it's crucial to discover a tailored method that meets your specific requirements and objectives. These signals are generic markers, yet they may give useful information. They should not be the main foundation for making choices regarding your health and fitness. It's always preferable to talk with a healthcare expert. They may give individualized guidance based on your unique circumstances, allowing you to attain your weight reduction objectives in a healthy and lasting manner. They may give tailored guidance. Remember, the path to greater health is a marathon, not a sprint. Take the time to study your body and make educated choices that will benefit you in the long term. One of the most visible indications of muscle loss is a decline in strength. This may be especially evident if you have been constantly working out and suddenly discover that you can't lift the same weights you used to. It's not just about the numbers on the weights, it's about the general sensation of weakness that might creep in. If you're losing muscle, you'll certainly notice that you're not as powerful as you used to be. This may be tremendously irritating, particularly if you have been putting in the effort to maintain or improve your strength. You could notice that workouts that were formerly simple for you are suddenly tough, and this might be a warning indicator that something is awry. You may struggle to lift the same weights. This isn't only restricted to hard lifting. Even lesser weights might seem more demanding. This reduction in strength might influence your total exercise performance and can be an indication that your muscle mass is declining. You could find it challenging to conduct bodyweight workouts. Push-ups, pull-ups, and even bodyweight squats might become increasingly challenging. These exercises depend significantly on muscular strength, and if your muscles are deteriorating, you'll notice a dramatic decline in your ability to do them. Muscle tissue is metabolically active. This implies that it burns calories even while you're at rest. The more muscle mass you have, the greater your resting metabolic rate, which aids in maintaining a healthy weight. It burns calories even at rest. This is one of the reasons why maintaining muscle mass is so crucial. When you lose muscle, your body becomes less effective at burning calories, which may contribute to weight gain over time. When you lose muscle, your metabolism slows down. This might make it tougher to lose weight and keep it off. A slowed metabolism indicates that your body is burning less calories, which may contribute to an increase in body fat. This makes it difficult to lose weight and keep it off. You can find yourself gaining weight even if your diet and workout habits haven't changed. This may be tremendously irritating and can make it seem like all your efforts are in vain. This is why it's crucial to retain muscle mass while attempting to shed fat. Incorporating strength training into your program might help you keep muscular mass and keep your metabolism working effectively. If you're witnessing a drop in your strength, it's crucial to take action. Don't disregard these indications. They are your body's way of informing you that something has to change. Incorporate strength training into your program. This may include movements like deadlifts, squats, and bench presses. These complex motions are good for growing and maintaining muscular mass. Focus on getting adequate protein. Protein is important for muscle repair and development. Make sure you're receiving enough protein in your diet to support your muscle maintenance efforts. These techniques may help you keep muscle mass by paying attention to your strength levels and making the appropriate modifications to your training and nutrition. You can preserve your muscle mass and keep your metabolism working effectively. Remember, your muscles are your body's engine, and keeping them strong is vital to general health and fitness. Another clear symptom of muscle loss is a weight reduction plateau. This may be tremendously upsetting, particularly if you've been dutifully following your food and exercise plan. You may first notice the numbers on the scale decrease, which may be encouraging and inspiring. However, this first decline may often be deceiving, but if you're losing muscle, your development may stagnate. This might lead to emotions of disappointment and irritation, making it difficult to remain motivated. This is because muscle loss might slow down your metabolism. A slowed metabolism means your body burns fewer calories at rest, making it tougher to lose weight. When you reach a plateau, 
it's crucial to review your food and exercise program, take a deeper look at what you're consuming and how you're working out. You may need to modify your calorie intake. Sometimes even tiny modifications in your diet may make a major effect. Consider raising the intensity of your exercises. Adding more demanding activities or increasing the time of your workouts might help you push over the plateau. Transcribed by HTTPS Otter, AI these tweaks might help you break past the plateau. Remember, it's about discovering what works best for your body and sticking with it. It's vital to realize that weight reduction is not always linear. There will be moments of fast growth and others when it seems like nothing is happening. There will be ups and downs along the road. It's a normal part of the process, and it's crucial to be patient and persistent. Don't become disheartened. If you reach a plateau, consider it as a chance to review and modify your strategy. Adjust your strategy and keep consistent with your efforts. Consistency is crucial, and with the appropriate changes you may overcome any plateau and continue on your weight reduction path. You may have heard of the phrase slim fat. This refers to persons who seem skinny yet have a high proportion of body fat. This typically happens when individuals lose weight too rapidly. They lose muscular mass along with fat. Losing muscle may lead to a reduction in body definition. You may find that your clothing fit differently. You may not notice the muscular tone you were looking for. To prevent becoming thin fat, concentrate on shedding fat while keeping muscle. This entails a mix of strength exercise, a balanced diet, and enough protein consumption. Fatigue and poor energy levels may be indications of several health issues. They may also be symptoms of muscle loss. Muscle tissue serves a critical part in energy generation. When you lose muscle, you may suffer a reduction in energy levels. This tiredness might present in numerous ways. You may feel exhausted all the time. You could find it tougher to encourage yourself to work out. If you're continually feeling fatigued, it's crucial to screen out any underlying medical concerns. Once issues are handled, work on adding strength training and a healthy diet into your program. A substantial drop in your physical performance might be a symptom of muscle loss. This might emerge in numerous ways. You may find it tougher to run as far as you used to. You could struggle to accomplish the same amount of repetitions in your exercises. Muscle loss may damage your balance, coordination, and general athletic performance. This might make it more tough to participate in physical activities you formerly loved. If you're an athlete, or someone who likes frequent physical exercise, it's vital to assess your performance. Any considerable reduction might suggest muscle atrophy. Hormonal abnormalities might lead to muscle loss. Testosterone, a hormone prevalent in both men and women, plays a critical function in muscle development and repair. As we age, our testosterone levels normally fall. This might make it more tough to maintain muscular mass. Other hormones, such as cortisol, the stress hormone, may also alter muscle mass. Chronic stress may lead to high cortisol levels. This may lead to muscular deterioration. Maintaining hormonal balance is vital for retaining muscle mass. This entails controlling stress, getting appropriate sleep, and participating in regular exercise. Adequate diet is vital for muscular health. When your body doesn't obtain the nutrients it needs, it may lead to muscle loss. Protein is especially vital for creating and repairing muscular tissue. If you're not ingesting enough protein, your body may start breaking down muscle for fuel. Other nutrients, such as vitamin D and magnesium, also play a role in muscle function. Deficiencies in these nutrients may lead to muscular weakening and loss. Focus on having a balanced diet that contains enough of protein, healthy fats, and complex carbs. This will offer your body with the nutrition it needs to sustain muscular mass. Strength training is vital for creating and maintaining muscular mass. When you lift weights, you generate small rips in your muscle fibers. Your body heals these breaks by utilizing protein to grow the muscle fibers back stronger. Aim to participate in strength training activities that target all major muscle groups at least twice a week. This will help you keep muscle mass and prevent muscle loss. Don't be scared to push yourself with weights. Gradually increase the weight or resistance as you grow stronger. This gradual stress is crucial for continuous muscular development. As noted before, protein is necessary for muscular health. When you're attempting to reduce weight, it's extremely crucial to focus protein consumption. Protein makes you feel full and satisfied. It may also help prevent muscle loss after weight reduction. Aim to ingest 0.8 to 1 gram of protein per pound of body weight every day. You may spread your protein consumption throughout the day by adding protein-rich meals in every meal. Good sources of protein include lean meats, poultry, fish, eggs, dairy products, beans, lentils, nuts, and seeds. Losing weight may be tough. It's crucial to concentrate on decreasing fat while keeping muscular mass. By identifying the indicators of muscle loss and taking efforts to avoid it, you may reach your weight reduction objectives while keeping a healthy and toned body. Remember to add strength training into your regimen, emphasize protein consumption, and fuel your body with a balanced diet. With the appropriate strategy, you may lose weight, increase muscle, and enhance your entire health and well-being. Looking for high-quality supplements backed by Dr. Andrew Huberman himself? Check out the links in the description below and subscribe and hit the bell icon if you've learned anything new or anything of value.